The Exchange Club is a national civic organization that got founded in 1911 by a group of individuals who believed strongly that the old-fashioned principles of truth and integrity and relationships really mattered. It's in all 50 states in the United States. The overall purpose of exchange around the country is child abuse prevention. I'm a big believer in helping those who can't help themselves, so children are a big part of that. The Diaper Bank in North Carolina provides diapers, period products, and adult incontinence supplies to families living in poverty throughout the region. There's no assistance for diapers. WIC and food stamps do not cover them, and they can cost up to $100 a month. Receiving support from the Exchange Club allows us to cover bottoms for the most needy families in the community. It allows us to provide dignity items for students and schools so they don't have to make a choice between attending class and having their period. Each club can have their own agendas. We found that we wanted to help multiple organizations. The Exchange Club of Greater Durham, through their volunteer efforts and fundraisers in the community, including the Blues and Brews Festival every year in downtown Durham, supports nonprofits across the housing continuum, across the care continuum, and in our schools to make sure that families are not just surviving, but thriving across the greater Durham area. The donation will help plan and support our outreach efforts to provide critical services to older adults in Durham. We plan to help more than 2,100 people over the next year by providing financial assistance for needed medications, comprehensive medication therapy management, care management and tailored community services, and Medicare insurance counseling. The name exchange really serves as the founding principle of wanting to exchange ideas and make their community stronger and better places to live. Sidekicks is a character education program, but the hook of the program is the martial arts. We know that kids need something when it comes to discipline, respect, self-control, self-confidence, and that's what this program is all about. And it's a game changer actually for Durham Public Schools because it has actually decreased the suspension rates as well as increased the academics. We started the Exchange Family Center. We funded them for every year they've been in existence. Exchange Family Center is a local nonprofit organization and we really work hard to prevent child abuse and neglect in Durham County. Over the last year alone, we served over 500 children and their families free of charge. And we were able to do that partially due to the funds that we're receiving from the Exchange Club of Greater Durham. Oh, the Blues and Brews Festival. It's the best festival in time in town, bar none. The Blues and Brews Festival has been around now going on seven years. Where in downtown Durham, hundreds of people gather, get to listen to the best artists out there for blues, and get to enjoy the best local brews here in North Carolina. We, I believe, raised $32,000 this year, which we were able to directly pump back into the community and organizations that we vet pretty much weekly at our lunches. And at the end of the year, we get together and we uh, vote on the people that we want to support and give our money to. It really is the way we give back to the community the most just because we raise so much money from it and we can help so many organizations and therefore so many children. Today is one of the best days to be in the Durham area and to be associated with the Exchange Club of Greater Durham. This is where all the money raised for all the hard efforts of both the club members and volunteers for the Blues and Bruce Festival get to go out among community deserving nonprofit organizations so that the work that's being done in our community can be supported and continued Today we're giving away money raised from our sixth annual Blues and Brews event. Over the past six years, from this event alone, we have raised approximately $190,000. We raised this year approximately $32,000, and we put that money back to good use in our community. Today's event is them having a representative come from their organization to receive our donation to them. Good afternoon, I'm Eunice O'Neill Sanders and I'm with Crams to Calculators, a nonprofit that provides free school supplies to every teacher in Durham Public Schools, all 54 schools. Hello everyone, thank you so much for this, your amazing support and for the donation today. I am with Book Harvest and we are at our 
eight millionth book, and this donation will definitely help us get to that two million before spring. Just a little bit for what this donation means to us. It allows us the opportunity to continue to serve our survivors. For some of you that are not aware, there are about 20 people every minute that are affected by some type of violence in the United States. Clubfoot is one of the most common congenital birth defects occurring in one in 700 births. However, it's readily treatable. Miracle Feet is on a mission to eliminate untreated clubfoot. Anyone who is committed to improving their community will find this organization to be beneficial. It makes me feel wonderful to, to give back to so many worthwhile organizations. People always ask the question of, how can I serve my community? The one thing that I can tell you is that the Exchange Club has given me a vehicle for answering that question. Anyone considering, I would say just come meet us. That's what did it for me. Obviously doing the work that we do and uh, raising the money for the community is great, but you gotta also have great people and that's what keeps me. Many hands make light work, so the more members we can have, the more things we can do and give back to the community. I think the thing about the club that has been very important to me are the relationships with the people. They are like a second family to me. It's a very rewarding experience or I wouldn't have been doing it for 41 years. 